Hi, everybody, and welcome to The Grace Grella Show. I am Grace Grella, your intuitive host, and as always, we're here because it's all about you and giving you that positive information you need in your life to put a little pep in your step, and hey, it's, it's all good. So everybody here is donating their, their time and their talent, and it's all about you. Woohoo! Can't get any better than that. If you're watching live, you can call me on the studio line which is 516-629-3705 or 3715. Um, if you'd like to uh, be here up, up close and personal and be read on camera, just send me your name and your information to gracegrella at gmail.com and we'll make it happen for you. That, hey, that's what we're here. It's, it's all about you. Uh, we're really excited. We have a very special guest tonight. Ta-da, ta-da! Returning from the Twilight Zone. <laughs> Erica, thanks for coming back. Thanks for having me. You, you sweet little Cancerian. <laughs> and it was four years ago you were here, and, and you don't remember, so the good news is it'll be all new to you. Yes, I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> Yay. All right, beautiful. So you know the drill. You know I'm just going to talk a mile a minute and yeah, give you the Western Union info. and. <laughs> Uh, and then we'll get to the cut to the chase and uh, get to the specific questions and people and issues so I cover everything. Okay. okay? All right. Excellent. All right. Let's see what's going on. Bella, bella. The first thing I'm hearing to uh, impart to you tonight is that there is an opportunity for you that's going to surface in October, okay, okay. Um, for some sort of business partnership. Oh. All right. So a friend of yours is going to uh, be talking about uh, either starting up a mail order catalog or something of this nature. And I, it has to do with products, either beauty products for women or jewelry for women. It's a product, a product line for women, okay. okay, retail kind of a feel to it. Mm -hmm. And uh, would like you to uh, partner up with her. Uh, really think about this because this is, um, Cancerians, anything to do with home-based businesses, mm -hmm. home cooking, food, you guys are money magnets, <laughs> right, uh, with those issues, so, because that's what you rule, all right, it, it's all, what, what, you rule, <laughs> so, it's, um, think about it, and it's all about that money, honey, you know as a Cancerian, you need that secret stash of cash <laughs> that nobody knows about, so you can feel emotionally secure, mm -hmm. right, yeah, so this is the universe's way of showing you how much you loved, and here, baby, have some more money, more money, more okay. money, okay, so that's always a good thing. I'll right. take it. So uh, next month, really consider it when a friend approaches you with this business opportunity. All right. Okay. Um, now, there's also something to do with a um, Tony or an Anthony. Who is this to you, please? I you don't, don't know him I, yet? No. Okay. Uh, the name Tony Anthony, this uh, individual looks to me as if he's only in his 30s. He's very young um, and tall, good looking. Um, very much the entrepreneur kind of an energy here. Okay. And um, something to do with leases, either leases for homes, cars, I don't know, a lot of things, businesses, a lot of things you can lease in life, but a new lease on life. Um, <laughs> but I just feel that this is someone that the universe is going to put into your life that once uh, he walks in, he'll always be in your life. That's the energy I'm getting. Okay. So it's a good thing, so no worries. Cool. Um, you'll know who they're referencing before the end of this year. Okay, great. Okay. A lot of Cancerians are getting ready to um, uh, start up a new uh, horizons insofar as relationships are concerned, like new people coming in. Okay. And Cancers don't like to get rid of anybody. So you have your entourage that you yeah. always hold on to, mm -hmm. but there's always room for one more. Okay. You know? Um, you know, so there's a movie with six, you get egg roll, you know, and so, <laughs> so, ah, yeah, Brib, sure, bring another one, it's okay. <laughs> so I kind of get that energy about this, that you're going to just be open to these new people that uh, are going to be put into your life within the next six months. Okay. Now, um, do you live in your own home? Do you currently own your own home? I don't own, but I live. You live in your own home? Yes. Okay. Um, so you're, you're renting it, you're leasing it? I'm renting it, yeah. Okay. I think this is where this guy Tony comes in. Oh. All right. I, and as I said, I didn't know what if he leases homes or this cars or whatever. Uh, there could be an opportunity for you to, uh, would you want to purchase his home? 
instead of just rent it? Yeah. Have the rent go towards option to buy? Yeah, I, would be, I wouldn't be opposed to it. Okay. Um, he might be the broker. He might be the one that um, uh, offers this opportunity to you. Okay. Okay. Um, and it looks like a good deal from what they're showing me. Like, Excellent. you know, you could embrace it and not worry about it. Cool. Um, are you currently single, meaning unmarried? Unmarried, yes. Yeah, okay. Um, the marriage part is going to, uh, question is going to be posed to you. All right. Uh, has this been, you're living with somebody for like two years? I've been wearing his engagement ring for two years. <laughs> All right. So you've been, oh, so yeah. for two years. Okay. I've so been with him forever, though. Okay. But for the past two years is the commit, commitment. Yeah, we've been engaged for two years. Okay. A year and so a half. the angels are right. You know, for the, uh, for the past two years, it's really gotten serious. And um, this is where the, uh, I think this is where the marriage in March could be coming from. Um, <laughs> and I kind of feel that uh, you would, do you like a, like a destination, like let's just get married on a beach? Wouldn't be opposed to it. Okay. Um, I kind of feel as a, a Cancerian woman, it's like, look, let's just do this already. Let's just seal the deal, you know? Mm -hmm. uh, and almost you saying, um, I, I, I release and relinquish the need for a big expensive party, you know. I texted him today, let's just run away and get married. <laughs> did you Today, really? this afternoon. I okay. did. The angels were watching. <laughs> okay, I feel like Joanne Worley from <laughs> laughing. Um, and you're too young to know who that was. But anyway, uh, there's, um, okay, so this is what's going on. Yeah. All right, it's like, let's just do it. And yeah, it's I, I like a beach and um, this beautiful uh, uh, archway of flowers. Uh, if you were Jewish, I'd say a nice hoppa. Hoppa. <laughs> yeah. Um, so congratulations in advance. Thank you so much. All right, because what uh, the universe really wants more than anything for Cancerian women in the next um, six to eight months is you guys sealing the deal, feeling okay. I have my significant other in my life. I have my commitment. Um, I'm emotionally secure, now I can go out and conquer the world again, all right? Okay. Because Cancerian women are brilliant business women, brilliant, okay? And um, your people skills, your ability to um, just network and really know how to utilize resources and tools, whether, whether it's people, things, you know, whatever. So all of this is going to be, uh, you're going to be a very happy camper. Good. Okay, so congratulations, you deserve that. it. Thank you so much. Um, now, who's got the two kids? Two kids. Yeah. Does he have one from, a, no. you have one from a previous no. marriage? I'm seeing two kids. Hmm. So this could, or, you know, sometimes animals could be like our children. Mm. So if you guys decide to adopt children or animals or, I don't know, but I see two. Okay. 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 Oh. All right. The family. The angels are saying you're going to have a family. I just told her in the car that I was <laughs> most likely going to have twins. Like, it's just genetically in tune. We were just talking about it before we got off the exit. Okay. Bingo. So That's weird. No, no sense. Well, welcome <laughs> to my world. Okay. Uh, I live in the world of weird. It's not so bad. Okay. Um, so this family of two. So it's not adoption. Here come the twins. Woohoo! And um, a, a, a beautiful family, a happy uh, contentment. And that's really what your soul yearns for, Erica. You know, it's just that peace of mind, a peace of heart, and you, that fullness of having your home and your loved ones. And, you know, yeah, yeah, that's, 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 it. that's your dream. And you're going to be living your dream. Excellent. So, yeah, that. congratulations. Thank you. Um, and you deserve it. You're such a sweetheart. All Cancerian women have hearts of gold, really. Unless somebody yeah. hurts you, then they better leave town or the country. Mm -hmm. Forget about town. They should just leave the country because um, you'll stalk them. <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> I will find you. <laughs> and it won't be pretty. <laughs> okay. Um, well, because uh, Cancerians forget nothing. Unless it's a reading from me from four years ago, but a bump. But Sorry. seriously, emotionally, emotionally, if somebody hurts you emotionally, mm -hmm. it's in there. It's never going away. Yeah. You might forgive it. It might, you know, it'll still, it'll mm -hmm. still irritate you. But yep. um, it's, it'll always linger. So yes. that's how deeply you feel. 
right? And that's why I admire Cancerian women so much. It's I can't even wrap my uh, my heart around that kind of depth of emotion. Mm. I, I just think it to me it's like a tsunami. Yeah. Whoa! You know, I it can can't be very overwhelming. That wave. <laughs> yeah, really. It can be overwhelming. <laughs> yeah. So you know, congratulations to you that you're able to. Um, uh, navigate those waters of emotion so brilliantly. Thank right? you so much. So just the observation, truthful observation. <laughs> um, and you know what? Aries women will always be truthful with you. Mm. You know, we're the soul sisters. You always want it. <laughs> okay, like there used to be an, uh, an old time song in Motown a days, tell it like it is. Mm. Uh, that's kind of a Aries theme song, you know. Mm. Uh, that's how we, uh, we are. Um, and some people are like, truth, you can't handle the truth. <laughs> but uh, we try to do it with love. And um, you're the same way. You have that diplomacy. When you uh, know that it's going to come out like, Row! you just shut down and, and you yes, clam up. You know? Um, so it's, that's a good thing. Because it, it shows how much you are in control. And you, you never really consciously want to hurt anybody or anything. Mm -hmm. So that's why all these wonderful blessings are coming your way, so honey. You know, the wedding, the two beautiful kids, <laughs> um, also a new car. Ooh. And, um, uh, well, you're going to need a vehicle that is uh, practical for the babies, you know? So, uh, uh, some, like an SUV kind of a thing. You know? Okay. Still be stylish. You can get a Beamer or whatever you okay. want, Mercedes, but it's, <laughs> it's um, you know, a an SUV kind of a thing. Okay. Um, and they're also showing me something to do with you need to grow things or, or dig in the dirt more or you know, for grounding. When you start feeling yourself um, uh, being overwhelmed because you're absorbing everybody else's emotions, and mm -hmm. you always do, uh, you know, go and uh, like uh, uh, buy a plant or repot a plant, or do you find you do it's, yourself doing it's this? It's odd because never in my life until this summer, Memorial Day, I started planting flowers and it was like the best therapy all summer. It really was. Okay. So Digging, watching things grow, watering them, yeah. taking care of them. And this is the angels have been watching you because this is what they're showing me. Okay, That's and funny. so they're applauding you that you're so in touch with yourself, babe, that you followed your own intuition and you went with it. And that's what they want you to, to continue to do, right? Okay. And it's, um, you know best how to heal yourself. You know, I'm just, uh, you know, the, the mouthpiece that are giving you the information from the angels, but you could talk to the angels yourself. You always do. Yeah, every day. Okay, yeah. And they're saying, uh, but we all need, because we're human, we all need that confirmation. Yeah. Is it live or memorized? Of course. So I'm, I'm pleased and privileged to be your confirmation. Thank you so much. Right? So, um, but trust yourself more, trust your intuition. It's always going to lead you in the right direction. Okay. Um, also, they, uh, they're asking about, who's Nancy to you? Nancy. Yeah. In, in regards to um, insurance matters. There might be something that comes up okay. with a change around insurance, either when you guys get married, um, and okay, now we have to let's uh, get joint stuff, mm -hmm. coverage, and uh, la 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 la. Um, uh, somebody named Nancy is going to be a really good insurance agent for you guys. So either she solicits or is recommended to you, okay. or I don't know. But just remember that name Nancy. with insurance, good for you, saves you money. Excellent. Um, always good. I love save saving money. money, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> And also, there's something to do with a um, Teresa, Terry, Teresa. And around this name, I want to say that this is someone that's going to help you with um, designing your new home oh. um, or redesigning your home to make it look like new, right? Um, when the, uh, the babies come, the nursery, okay? okay. Uh, remember that name, too. Somebody that will be recommended to you. Uh, like design on a dime, you know, oh. but everything is beautiful. Yes, Terry, Teresa. Do you, are you a collector? Do you collect things? Yeah, I guess so. Oh, more so when I was younger. I don't get rid of anything. Right. Of course not. You're I'm not a theory. hoarder, but I, you know, yeah, I, I you hoard on to things. things. And hold on to things. Yes. And yeah, of course. And um, they're sh but they're showing me this cute little figurine collection. Do you have something I like do. that? Yeah. Okay. Um, there's um, somehow it's going to be very special in connection with the kids. Okay. And either you're going to tell them stories, and Cancerians are brilliant storytellers. Mm. 
So you making up stories to your kids about the figurines that make them come to life or, you know, all this, um, okay. uh, you're really going to give them fertile um, uh, ground for their imaginations. You're going to be a great mommy. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you so much. So it's awesome. I hope so. I know so. Um, also, there's something to do with um, one of your girlfriends asking if you want to um, go up to New England, and I keep seeing Boston, and but it's in the month of November. Okay. And uh, but it looks like a great girls' trip or something along these lines, and like an overnight kind of a thing. Okay. Um, really consider doing that because it's. Um, um, you're like going to be right on the water, whether it's Cape Cod or Martha's Vineyard or whatever, but it's like right on the water and the ocean. It, it, that's heaven for you. It is. You know, it's so restorative. <laughs> mm -hmm. So, you know, before all the, uh, you know, the, the Huzzerai starts with you planning the destination wedding, mm. and it's just going to be um, uh, you guys and like really close knit family. Like I said, you're going to forego the, the, the big. Fakakta party, as they would say. Yeah. Um, it's going to be small, meaningful. It's all about love, you know. Yeah. And um, then later on, you'll have like a, at a restaurant, you'll have the pate <laughs> with uh, like a lot of friends and stuff like that. Cool. Okay. Um, now, what was really important for you, and what did you want to know more about? Uh, I mean, you really kind of talked about it. <laughs> um, I guess my mom right now. What's your mom's birthday, honey? It's July eighteenth. Two Cancerians. I'm the queen. No, I'm the queen. No, I'm the queen. No, she's the queen. She's got the crown. Okay. Um, all right. Mm -hmm. So that's a tough one because just that, you know, it's um, uh, you're so much alike that uh, sometimes it can uh, cause friction. <laughs> right? Yes. And I'm putting it mildly. Yes. We are on TV. Okay. <laughs> um, so it's. Um, it's taking the high road, which you always do, God bless your soul, you. and recognizing that um, your insecurities times 10, that's your mother. <laughs> Ouch. Imagine yeah. trying to live with that. Yeah. Okay. Um, so forgiveness. And the angels are saying you, you just need to find that forgiveness um, and, uh, in your heart. And um, she did the best she could. You know, mm -hmm. um, but she always has cutting words for you, and that's <laughs> annoys the living daylights out of you. Yeah. It's like for once, could you be nice? For <laughs> once, could you tell me I'm pretty? For <laughs> once, could you give me a compliment? You know, so it's um, it's just she doesn't know how. It's not in her vocabulary, so. Um, don't take it personally. She's like that with everybody. Okay. Right? Um, but you do take it personally because you're Cancerian and everything is personal. So, uh, but the angels want you to know that just forgive her um, and try as much as you can to make peace with her okay. before she leaves the planet. Because um, that will be a regret that you won't want to live with later on. Yeah. Okay. okay. Uh, but uh, they're saying that things will get, uh, once the grandchildren come, hmm. Um, she's going to have like a, 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 she'll be a transformed woman to a point, mm. okay? Okay. Um, and she'll be able to lavish them maybe with the affection and whatever that she couldn't have with you. Okay. All right. Okay. So uh, maybe vicariously if you see her being um, loving and caring and nurturing to your kids, you can uh, like absorb a little bit of it and say, oh, that's what she couldn't do for me, but, she's you know. She's giving it to them. You know, okay. um, but you're a Cancerian because I, I can't say it's ever going to make it better for you. It's not, yeah. right? But at least come to peace with it, and yeah. then you don't have to be uh, tortured with it. Okay. Okay. Just whew, let it Fair go. Um, <laughs> yeah. Really enough. enough. You know, if you've, you've been through enough. You've dealt with enough. Let it go. Okay. Um, also, that there's something to do with a um, who's Paul. Connected with um, uh, real estate. Real estate. Either a real, uh, real estate uh, broker, a realtor, 
um, mortgages, something, something. When uh, this opportunity comes up about you with the option to buy with the house thing, mm -hmm. uh, this could be somebody else that would be helpful as well. Okay. All right, so just remember that Tony and Paul, Tony those two names. Okay. Right? Um, also, um, did you misplace a ring recently? Recently. Yeah, like a pinky ring. Yeah, I did. And you found it though, right? I haven't found it. Oh, they're, they're going to help you find it. Huh? They're showing me the pink and, pinky ring that you misplaced. It will be back on the finger, they said. Hmm. All right. Good, um, I like that ring. <laughs> and they said that um, it had something to do with uh, the, the console in the car. Okay. Look in between the seats. Okay. Uh, okay. We'll you know, sometimes you're, you're, when your hands get cold, and then it just kind of slips off a little bit. Hmm. Or you were reaching for something and then you didn't realize it got caught and you, and you were distracted. And rush. Yeah. So check that Checking out. Checking that out when I get home. Okay, good. <laughs> um, shoot me the email. <laughs> Hi, Satanic. <laughs> well, uh, <clears throat> although I really, honest, I don't want to be the lost and found people. Please. <laughs> you know, do what I do, ask St. Anthony. He always comes he through. Does help. You know, I love St. Anthony. <laughs> I, help. I tease. I say, Tony, son of Barney, help me out with this. <laughs> um, and for those of Thanks you well. who don't know about St. Anthony, he's great. He helps you find lost things. Uh, supposedly, it's supposed to be souls, but hey, we're in the material world. If I lose a bracelet, it's St. Anthony, please come around. Something's <laughs> lost that needs to be found. And, um, and he will help you out. Has never failed me. So uh, he's going to help you. Thank right? you. I can't wait. And, Check that out when I get home. Yeah, totally. And also, what's going on with the sleepless nights? They're saying you're not sleeping. I haven't been sleeping. <laughs> and I'm a little restless recently. Yeah, tossing and turning. Tossing and turning all night. You're just like my Wurlitzer is having fun with you. <laughs> um, you well, because of your anxiety, they're saying. And uh, you worry. And if there isn't anything to worry about, you kind of conjure it up. Mm -hmm. And they're saying, uh, relax, uh, the angels have your back. Okay? Okay. So, um, uh, uh, um, from the Lion King, a, a tuna Makata, no worries, you know. <laughs> uh, uh, no worries. Um, but at least if you can um, meditate and by meditating for you it's going to be taking yourself back to that scene in nature where you were relaxed whether it's lying on a beach and feeling the sun on your face or hearing the seagulls or you know mm -hmm. um, that point in time where you were felt uh, relaxed and at peace with yourself take yourself back there okay. and you could do it because you forget nothing okay <laughs> especially the moments that bring you joy too Mm -hmm. Right, and then it's like recreating it, and then your body will relax. Okay. Um, have you ever tried yoga? Once years ago, and it didn't work. For I you. enjoyed it. I just okay. That might be something that you want want to try to revisit. Okay. Okay, that Thought would be about it. Uh, yeah. It would help you, and um, on a lot of different levels, and um, also they're saying that there's something to do with a. Um, <laughs> this is so funny. Um, I don't know why I'm seeing this, but they keep, oh, show, they keep showing me <laughs> Hare Krishnas um, and the Beatles with the Nehru jackets, and okay. I don't know why. And um, uh, uh, the Beatles in that time zone, um, so 60s, 70s. Um, Yeah, and um, <laughs> now I'm seeing uh, Ben Kingsley is Mahatma Gandhi. Well, it's it's all um, it's all seems to be um, having something to do again with um, with you finding your inner peace. I think. Okay, go let it be. Yeah, yeah. There you go. Let it be. You just you just <laughs> solve the puzzle for me. So oh, that's why I love Cancerians. It's like you get it. You're on the wavelength. I don't have to work so hard. Okay. So uh, yeah, let it be. Excellent. I'll let it be. All right. Um, any specific questions that you have for me? I really don't. You touched on my marriage and my <laughs> job, the kids, the kids, which I'm super excited about. Yeah. Um, 
And your, your, your newfound Martha Stewart ability with yeah, the planting, planting. With the flowers. And I'm getting very creative. Mm -hmm. I'm loving it. Mm -hmm. No, I have no other questions. I really, awesome. This was wow. awesome. Thank you so Good. much. Well, it's my pleasure. And, you know, it's, it's all about when you um, uh, key into things or if you uh, finally figure it out, just shoot me the email because I really love that feedback. Okay. You know, like, Grace, I thought you were cray-cray, <laughs> but guess what happened? And, you know. I found Teresa. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Found her. You know, I found my pinky ring. Okay. Yep. Uh, Tony, whoa, he came through. <laughs> Tony boy, we love you. And um, so whatever it is, please do that. And be gentle with yourself. Because as I said, all Cancerians right now are going through that uh, six to eight month thing uh, with relationships and uh, are really just welcoming, uh, you know, taking new people in and um, not getting rid of the ones you already got yeah. because, you know, you got to hold on to them. Okay. But um, it's, it's uh, expanding your horizons. And so for all Cancerians, it's just going to be brilliant. So you got a lot of br uh, fabulous things to look forward to in the next six to eight months. Okay. Um, also, just be a little patient with yourself. Um, if you get a little forgetful, now mm -hmm. you know who to call on. Mm -hmm. Tony the man. <laughs> and I don't know where time goes when I do the yeah, show, Erica. Really? It's like Come flies on. by, doesn't it? And, <laughs> but for everybody watching live, thank you so much for tuning in. And uh, please allow me to tune in for you. Either call me on my next show, October 22nd, same bad time, same bad channel. Email me your question at gracegrella at gmail.com. Or if you'd like to be here live in the studio and get your information on camera, we'll arrange it for you. We're all about the love. Have a good night. Thanks for watching. Hey! <laughs> Goes by so fast. So fast.